All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Unbreakable Grind, man. It's your guy CJ back with another video. Yeah. Uh, the camera's gonna be a little shaky while I'm driving, but whatever. All right. So somebody told me that I was being misleading <clears throat> because I was implying that everyone could be successful. They then let me know that that's not realistic. Everyone can't be successful. The world wouldn't even work with it if everyone was successful. And Everyone has unique paths and unique uh, outcomes, so everyone can be successful, all right? Long story short. I'm here to tell you that like that's a misconception. Uh, you're right and wrong. So I used to always wonder like why wasn't why everyone wasn't successful and it used to like mind boggle me. I always thought like I used to think that poverty and like suppress I used to think that like racial suppression and stuff and like gender suppression and you know, sexual orientation suppression. I used to think that like all these things were like the reasons people weren't successful, you know, but like come to find out everyone actually can be successful, right? So before I even get into it, I wanna clarify something. If you start in your mid twenties and just put 500 a month in a Roth IRA, right? You're a millionaire by the time you're 60. All right, and that's if you only do that. So you can do that with a McDonald's job, right? So at a, with the job at McDonald's, making roughly 800 or 1,000 a month, I mean a year, a, year a, a month, sorry about that. You can do that. Now, you're living, you will have to live at a bare minimum for, for 30, 40 years, and people might say that's not realistic. But what I want you to know is that you can do that, you can be a millionaire that easy <laughs> in America. A whole millionaire that easy, right? Now, who's actually gonna do it? Like everyone knows that you can put 500 a month by the time you're mid-20s, but who's out there is putting 500 a month? Tell me, you know, anybody in the comments, if you've been putting 500 a month since your mid-20s, let me know, almost no one. It's not new, it's not new news, just no one's gonna do it. So what I wanna, what I wanna clarify and what I've come to understand is that every, no one will do the work to win. What I found out is no one will do the work. We, so in America, it's not about become, it's not about if someone can become successful. Because even with our most minimum wage jobs, you can live at a bare minimum. You can live at a low, uh, you know, you can live below your means and you can be a millionaire. So with that being said, it's not about, the question isn't if everyone can be successful because it's clearly yes, almost everyone can. Of course, there are exceptions, but they are exceptions. Almost everyone can here, right? So then the question is, why does why do most people not become successful? That's the real question. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And you can define success wherever you want. Success isn't being a millionaire, right? You're, you don't have to be a millionaire. I, that's just, that's I, a lot of times I'm reflecting out how I think, all right? so. I'm telling you that I always wanted to be a millionaire by the time I'm 28, and I'm 28 right now, and I became a millionaire in late 27. So that's my effing criteria. But at the end of the day, I, I wonder why are most people not where they wanna be, all right? And with that being said, what I've come to find out is no one really actually wants to be do the work, all right? It's just, it's just, I can't put it in a shorter way than that, right? Like, think about it. I think about how I became successful. I literally did not party in my best, like my 20s, like think of my young 20s, man, I didn't go to any parties. Think about that. Who really is gonna not go to parties? Like literally none. Not have friends. I had no friend. I have no friends. I, I didn't even develop friends. I literally was so freaking busy. I don't even have friends. My family members can't name a friend of mine because I don't have any. They can't name a friend I've had because I don't. I've never had them. I didn't start having them and then stop. I never had them. I never developed them. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? So, who's gonna not have friends? Not have a social life? Literally study the hardest freaking skill sets possible with delayed gratification, not getting a reward in the short term at all. Four or five years, six years, no no return on it, really at all. Right? 
live on bare minimum stuff. I was even at one time, I used to get the freaking uh, food stamps. Heck yeah, I used to get the food stamps. And I used to eat, I used to get the peanut butter and bread and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Who's gonna live that bare? Who's gonna just do that, not party, work out? I was working out, I was in shape. This is what's crazy, man. I was in shape, working out, looking good and still didn't go to parties. I still, I li literally, I had chicks trying to, I had chicks chasing me and everything at one point in college and I still didn't go to parties. I ignore every chick. I just study. I said, F them chicks. I was study. Who really is going to do that? Like, you got to think about this. Who's going to delay gratification that long, that hard? Like, you have to think about this. Even once I started getting paid, right? I, I was working nonstop. So, literally, when I was in college, I had freaking hard palpitations because I was learning skills. Because, you know, college doesn't teach you the exact skills you need. So, I was learning the skills I need. And I was learning, doing the college stuff. And I was doing internships. I was saving money. When I got out of college, I was in debt. So after college, me and my girl, we saved up like two, we saved up like 200 grand, but we had 200 grand student loan debt. Who literally, think about this. Who is gonna work their butt off hard for like two years, save up 200 grand, and spend every single dollar on, on their student loans? There are people right now that have money to pay off their student loan debt. They're not gonna pay it off. They're gonna go, they're, they're gonna buy like a, they're gonna probably go buy a house, I'll go buy a car. Who's crazy enough to say, you know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna delay gratification even more and pay off all my debt. So it's the absurd. What I found out is like, we really want the reward. No one wants the pass. No one wants to, no one really want, no one wants to, no one wants to enjoy the journey. No one wants to endure the journey, man. And that's what I've come to understand. So after all that delayed gratification, I saved up the money and then I spent, we spent all the freaking cash on student loan debt. We were back at zero again after working four years, five years on all these skills. We were working, doing stuff in college, internships. We freaking worked two more years. We saved up 200K. We spent it all on student loan debts, went right back to zero again. Kept working nonstop 80 hour weeks again. Start saving money back up again. It's crazy. Just same car. I'm in my college car right now. This is my, this is my college car right now. I'm in my college car right now. This is the car I had in college. Right now. <laughs> like, who's gonna do that? I can literally go buy any car. I can. <laughs> I can literally go buy any car. One. Literally, anyone cash. And this is my college car. Who's, so the question isn't, is, can everybody be successful? Everyone has the opportunity in America to be successful. And if you don't think so, you are being manipulated and you, I don't know, I, you need guidance and I will help you. I will help guide you out of that stuck spot. Oh man, it's a car show, this is cool. So what I want you to understand is almost no one would do what it takes to be successful. Now that's a different question. Will, why do most people not do what it takes to be successful? It's just too freaking hard, man. Now, what I've come to find out is it's way too freaking hard, man. No one, not, no one's gonna, and it's not complicated. That's what you have to understand. Complicated means there's all kinds of parts to it. It's not complicated. It's simple, right? It's very simple. It's not complicated, but it's very, very hard. It's difficult. Because even though it's simple, no one can stick to it. You know what I'm saying? So I want you guys to really take that in, man. I'm almost at the gym, but I've been I've been working nonstop. Right now, I'm tired, man. I've been I still do 80 I still do 80 hour weeks right now. I thought I was gonna be done, but I just can't. I'm always thinking about the next generation. That's what that's my passion. I like thinking about changing the changing the world for my next generation, or at least changing my 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 family's world at first. And if I can get big enough, I want to change as many people's lives as I can, help as many people's lives as I can. That hits the YouTube channel, you get what I'm saying? But I need you to understand, man, a lot of you out there grinding that are really doing the work, shout out to you, because there's some young dudes out here, man. You got some young dudes going crazy, and I'm proud to see it. There are very few of these young women and dudes. There are some young ladies and young men that are doing the real work. These people, man, these young people are skipping parties, Effing, effing, skipping 
uh, the effing, uh, skipping all delayed gratification, minimizing the expenses, not looking, not wearing cool clothes. Man, how many times? Think about it. Every car video you see me, and I got the same shirt. This I, I don't even do that on purpose. I just realized this is the same green shirt. Go to any time I'm talking and I'm going to the gym. It's almost every time this shirt. This is a Goodwill shirt I got in college. I cut the sleeves off and made it a freaking muscle shirt. This is my favorite shirt. Come on, bro. I can buy anything I want, and I don't even want. I want this shirt. You have to think about it. Who's like that? So to wrap the video up, man, no one, it's a, it's, it's a special type of person that's gonna be extremely successful, all right? It's just, it, it just is. Because, and it's not because they're, spe for the, three, the thing that makes them special is they just have this fight and they don't, they don't, they just willing to fight and delay gratification, man. Hopefully that means something to someone, man. With that being said, if you like this content, hit that like button. Subscribe if you want more videos. Notification, you want those immediately. I promise to keep the heat coming, guys. I gotta get in here and get this work, man. Peace. Ah.